hello everyone good day so for today's video i will just sitting down in here while talking about the best time to visit here in the philippines because i know many of you guys are planning to visit here in the philippines and don't know oh which is the best time to visit here yes because many uh, travelers are experienced in typhoon during their travels and also they experience a lot of delayed of travels or delayed of flights so this video will help you guys and yeah will help you and give lessons also to those travelers who experience delays here in the philippines because uh, many travelers now are they are really um, complaining about um about like they're experiencing a lot of delays of flight so that is not good because if you are experiencing delayed of flights oh my god that is a lot more expenses for you because if you yeah there is delayed of flights and if you are traveling here from dumaguete and you experience delayed of flights here and you travel dumaguete going to manila for to get your international flights and you miss it so they will not refund you so here i will give you some tips and also a story or a experience of one of my subscribers who traveled here in the philippines stay tuned So the Philippines have a tropical marine time so it has relatively high temperature and high humidity and a lot of rains. So why is it considered as tropical country? Philippines considered a tropical country because it is near the equator and has only wet and dry seasons. So as opposed to other countries that they have four seasons due to their locations. So the climate change here in the country can be divided into two majors, two major seasons based on the temperature and the rainfall. So we have the rainy season which runs from June to November. Remember that guys from june to november and our dry seasons which runs from december to may but don't be com compatible about that because you know even december to february we experience a lot of rains yes so yes the best time it is like from march to april something or march to may but may um for months of may month of may the wet season will already start but it usually start at june but during may we ex also experience like what happened this year we experience typhoon so oh my god the weather is here is unpredictable so there's a lot of changes or climate change so you need to be prepare prepare on that so when is the best time to visit here in the philippines so there are many reasons to visit here in the philippines but if you want adventure and there are many places um there are many places here that you can go if you are an adventurous tourist you should visit philippines during the dry seasons why because the philippines has 7641 7, islands you will need to travel extensively climate change is normal here and even in summer we can expect rain at least five times per month so more or less five times a month so we have a lot of rain almost every day during the wet seasons so it's not good for you it's not good for you as a as a, a adventure tourist or adventurous person so i will share you this experience based on uh, yeah, i will share you this story about based on john's experience here in the philippines so john is one of my subscribers who spent seven days in the philippines during his seven days he encountered a lot of rains and flight delays so which caused him to miss flights back to london and i know seven days is too short um it's too short for sightseeing adventures but you won't believe how many places he visited here in the philippines even it was raining even he experienced typhoon here in the philippines so 
the weather was extensively or extre extremely bad but he survived and quickly adapt to filipino food and the weather so john arrived here in the philippines on may 31 and began his adventure from june 1 to 7 because his um his adventure here or yeah he only he only seven days for his visit here in the philippines so he experienced his experience was excellent he went on adventure and enjoyed the beautiful places here in the philippines even the weather was very bad so the weather was the only negative aspect of his adventure the wet season has already began making travel was difficult especially to another island after finishing his seven days adventure he went to panglao international airport to catch a flight going back to manila then back to london because his international um, plane was in manila so his flight back to london was 6 p.m but his flight from Panglao to Manila was 1 p.m. but it was cancelled so due to the weather conditions he waited another flights for five hours and arrived in Manila at 7 p.m. unfortunately he missed his flight back to London so he will have to purchase another ticket the bad news was that he missed his flight due to weather conditions and there was no refund available because he missed the flight so as a result he missed his flight and lost a lot of money yeah because um flight going back to london it will cost a lot of money so he misses flights and lost a lot of money so my advice is that if you are traveling here in the philippines whether wet or dry season you should travel to the locations where your international flight is located and ahead of time like a day before your flight going back to your country because our weather here can change anytime and causing flight delays so the last advice that this 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 is the last advice which is very important to you guys um make a travel itinerary so a travel itinerary will help you plan your road manage your expenses and keep track of your time because you know um if you're not if you don't have itinerary you don't know where to go and maybe sometimes you will change your decisions and now i, I, will, I need to go to this place this is so beautiful so before going or before traveling or before you get a flight going here in the philippines you should have your itinerary travel itinerary arrange everything and also your expenses because you know i know that you can afford everything and some of you are not and some of you are need to budget your money yes so for people who are budgeting money you need to have your itinerary that is very big help for you to manage your expenses time and road destinations because you know it is hard when you are broke here in the philippines and yeah so especially when you are on dating with someone and she is taking you to some be beautiful and expensive places so you should plan that first before traveling here in the philippines that is my um tips and advice for you guys so that's all everyone Hopefully this um, this video will help you a lot when you travel here in the Philippines. Come, shout out, decide and come to the Philippines and enjoy the beautiful places and the paradise that you will never forget. So thank you everyone for watching and please don't forget to like, comment. If you like this video, just leave me a comment below and please subscribe for, um, for my non-subscriber. Please subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell for you to notify for my next videos and bye everyone love you all